Roman Reigns has received some very bad news from WWE, and he is very upset about it, as it seems that his WrestleMania dreams have been shattered. On the road to WrestleMania 39, anticipation is growing for the match between the undisputed WWE Universal Champion Roman Reigns and Cody Rhodes. However, this year, the road to WrestleMania has been completely changed, and as the countdown is on, Roman Reigns is very worried. Fans are definitely wondering if Cody Rhodes can defeat Roman Reigns and take his two titles, but it seems that that is now going to be impossible, as a huge surprise is about to happen, and it will definitely change WWE as we know it. For the first time, we saw Roman Reigns go face-to-face -face with Cody Rhodes. Roman said some very mean things to Cody about Cody's father, Dusty Rhodes, but Roman Reigns did extend his hand, and Cody shook it. But there still seems to be a lot of tension between these two men, and obviously it will come to a head at WrestleMania 39 this year. But Roman Reigns was shocked when he was called into a secret meeting prior to that face-off, and he was told that the plan for WrestleMania 39 has been changed, and what he thought was going to happen is not going to happen. According to insiders, WWE officials have been working around the clock because they got late word a certain wrestler that they had been trying to get for WrestleMania suddenly became available, and they are now rearranging the whole WrestleMania plan. And in this secret meeting, they told Roman Reigns about what this secret plan includes. And when he was told, he was shocked beyond belief. Both Triple H and Vince McMahon were in this meeting with Roman Reigns as they let Roman Reigns know what he could expect in the coming weeks on the road to WrestleMania, and then what the plan would be for the actual WrestleMania pay-per-view. Now, as we know, WrestleMania this year is going to be a two-night event. Part one will be on Saturday, part two will be on Sunday. Now, originally, Roman Reigns was supposed to face off against Cody Rhodes on night two in the main event, but According to insiders, that plan has changed, and Roman Reigns is not happy about it. So because WrestleMania is now a two-night event, they need two big main events, and they are doing everything they can to make this WrestleMania the biggest of all time. And they believe that if they have two mega main events, Fans will all agree that this was truly the biggest WrestleMania of all time, and in order to do that, they need those two huge main events. Now, they already had one big main event with Cody Rhodes versus Roman on night two, but they felt like they didn't have that huge main event for night one. Yeah, they had some possibilities, but the level of interest just wasn't there compared to the Roman versus Cody match. And they've been scrambling to try and find a way to get a huge main event on night one so that people don't just say, oh, I'm not going to watch night one. I'm just going to watch night two because Roman and Cody, that's the big match for WrestleMania 39. And that's the only one I care about. So in this secret meeting, Triple H and Vince McMahon told Roman that they made a call to a wrestler who has not been in WWE for some time. And that wrestler is none other than Roman Reigns' own cousin, The Rock. Now, The Rock has been very busy leading up to WrestleMania. That's because he launched a new version of the XFL, Vince McMahon's former football league. The Rock and his ex-wife bought the XFL and they made some big deals with some TV stations. 
and it was much more lucrative than to just wrestle at WrestleMania. So The Rock chose the XFL over WrestleMania because obviously there were rumors that The Rock was going to face off with Roman Reigns for the Undisputed Championship. But those plans were changed because of The Rock's busy schedule and the match was changed to Roman versus Cody. But now it seems that The Rock let WWE know that if they're still interested, he actually is available. It seems that the XFL has been launched, it's being taken care of, they're playing their season, but also a movie that The Rock was supposed to film around WrestleMania time has been canceled due to some financing issues. And The Rock said, hey, if you need me, I'll be there. And Vince McMahon and Triple H said, okay, this is interesting, what can we do? And they talked to Roman about it. And they said, well, what if we made WrestleMania 39 the biggest of all time? Night two, we have Cody versus Roman. But night one, we have The Rock versus Roman. And in each of these matches, Roman will put up one of his titles. So they will separate the titles. And on night one against The Rock, Roman will put up his universal title. And then on night two against Cody Rhodes, Roman will put up his WWE title. And according to insiders, Roman was not only told that this was going to happen, but he was also told who was going to win those matches. And unfortunately, Roman was told that he was going to lose both matches, which meant Roman was going to lose both of his titles. On night one, The Rock is now scheduled to defeat Roman Reigns and win the Universal Championship. And then on night two, Cody Rhodes will defeat Roman Reigns and win the WWE Championship. And this will all play into the storyline of the bloodline falling apart. And Roman will then blame the remaining members of the bloodline for his loss and it will send the bloodline into further chaos. But the big news is that the plans for WrestleMania 39 have changed, and Roman Reigns, unfortunately, will lose both of his titles at the pay-per-view. What are your thoughts about the plan to separate Roman's championships and give one to The Rock and give the other one to Cody Rhodes? Leave a comment below and give me your opinion. And don't forget to subscribe and click the bell notification and check out our new YouTube channel, Wrestling News Now Insider. Click on the link to visit it now and you will get brand new exclusive videos.